Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The navigation pane, which appears as a collapsed pane at the left side of the main document window, displays three buttons by default. When clicked, each button opens a different panel within the navigation pane. The three buttons shown by default within the navigation pane are page thumbnails, bookmarks, and attachments. In this lesson, you will learn about the functions available within these panels. You can right-click the button bar at the far left side of the navigation pane to see a pop-up menu of buttons that represent all the available panels that can appear within the navigation pane. Buttons within this pop-up menu that show a check mark next to their names currently appear within the button bar in the navigation pane. Buttons without a check mark next to their names do not appear here. You can click the button names in the pop-up menu to show the associated panels within the navigation pane and add the button to the button bar at the left side of the navigation pane. After that, you can then simply click the associated button at the left side of the navigation pane in the future to view the associated panel. To remove the panel buttons you have added to the navigation pane, right-click the navigation pane and then select the Reset Panes command to reset the display of the navigation pane to its original three buttons. Click the Page Thumbnails button to display the Page Thumbnails panel. Here, small thumbnail images of each page in the currently displayed PDF appear. You can see each page's number below each thumbnail image. You can click a thumbnail to display the associated page in the document window pane. You can use the scroll bar at the right side of the panel to scroll through many pages if needed. At the top of this panel are a few buttons. Each panel that appears within the navigation pane contains a toolbar at the top of the panel. Let's look at the buttons in the toolbar at the top of the Page Thumbnails panel. The Options button is the one with the drop-down menu. This menu contains common page editing tools. The Delete Page button, Insert Page from Another File, Rotate Counterclockwise, and Rotate Clockwise buttons appear to the right. In the upper right corner of the Navigation pane, you can click the Close button to close the panel you are currently viewing within the Navigation pane. This button appears within all the panels in this pane. Click the Bookmarks button below the Page Thumbnails button in the Navigation pane to expand the Bookmarks panel. This panel lets you navigate through bookmarks in a PDF. The leftmost button in the toolbar at the top of the Bookmarks panel is an Options button which contains commands used to manage bookmarks. There are also buttons that let you delete bookmarks, add a new bookmark, or find the current bookmark. Notice how when you click on the various bookmarks in the pane, the main document window changes to reflect those bookmark points in the active PDF file. To collapse this pane, click the Close button at the top of the panel. Click the Attachments button underneath the Bookmarks button in the Navigation pane to expand the Attachments panel. This panel behaves in much the same way as the Bookmarks panel. In the toolbar at the top of the panel is an Options button which contains commands related to file attachments. This toolbar also contains buttons for opening, saving, adding new, deleting, and searching for attachment files within the PDF. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.